Hello and welcome to my Minecraft video. This is episode number 9 of my Let's Play Solo Survival series. I'm Honeysuckle and today we are setting up a tree farm area here and I'm going to do this in time lapse just to speed things along. I'm just going to be clearing it out, flattening it out, lining out where my oak trees are going to go, birch trees, spruce trees, over there I'll have two dark oak trees. I'll worry about the other trees later if and when I find them. So enjoy the time lapse and here we go. did get the places where the trees are going to be laid out. Just need to finish up this section of the wall. Plan on putting a fence around the top just to keep any monsters out. Lighting it all up with torches. So once all that is done, I can plant my trees and it'll be safe from mobs coming in while I'm working in here. So I want to go ahead and light it up. Put the fences around, plant some trees, and I will be back in just a bit. The tree farm is done. As you can see, I put some of the dark oak fences around just because I, I love that color of wood. I believe that's my favorite wood, is the dark oak. I also like the spruce and the birch. And oak is good for regular stuff. Do like the floorings. Now I did plant these side by side by side. I knew the oak trees would plant that way and grow just fine. I had not previously known that birch and spruce would do that. I learned that from watching Grandma's Gone Gaming, so thank you very much to her for that tip. I'm just waiting for the trees to grow in. Once they finish out, we can start harvesting because I want to build a couple things. As you can see over here, I do have a foundation laid out, and this is going to be a horse stable. 
this is the very outside foundation laid out and I will come back and build it up and show you how I'm going to do that now I do want to use red wool for the walls just because it's easier to collect over here you can see all the different dyes I've been able to collect from squid and flowers and lapis things like that so I did go ahead and dye some sheep um, I don't have brown yet that one's going to be the cyan but I don't have any green so I've been unable to do any of the colors with blue and green I think that one's supposed to be white and that one's going to be the brown one we have all these others this will be lime green green cyan so those are the only four colors I'm missing and I need to find a desert biome to cook cactus to get the green color and a jungle biome to get the cocoa beans so I can get the brown so that's not too bad just missing those four colors so far and I'm going to go ahead and collect a bunch of the red wool so I have enough to do my stable and once I get all that collected up I will probably be back and we will do a time lapse of my staple build again I will need a lot of fences to do that and several gates and the way it's going to be is this will be the center aisle down through it and I will have stalls down the side I believe I have room for eight total which will be four down each side and I've seen this stable built before on a much bigger scale in a video I was watching I was so sorry I forget who it was I saw that built the stable like that but I will go back and hopefully find the link to that video so you can see it um, if not you know if you're the creator of that stable style please drop me a message and I will be more than happy to link to your video this will be a much smaller scale and a few tweaks to make it my own now I did find a carrot from a zombie so I started with one and I've been planting and filling up here trying to get carrots going so at least I do have a different crop other than just wheat which means now I'll be able to uh, breed some pigs so I think I will also go ahead and just set up a little pig pen and get some pigs in here go ahead and do that um, you might notice I'm planting in rows here they actually do grow a little bit faster when you're starting out if you do them in rows and leave a blank tilled ground in between this is a tip I picked up from Wells Knight Gaming one of my favorite youtubers that I subscribe to and I enjoy his videos so if you haven't heard of him or checked out anything he's done go ahead and do that I will put a link down in the description for Wells Knight and his channel check out his newest series Wells Knight Realm he's got 10 episodes out real quick just building up his world and he's he and Good Times with Scar are two of my favorites they have both inspired me to do a let's play where I'm going to build up and pretty much conquer this entire world and make it mine so that's where I'm going to leave off for now, and until next time, bye!